Hello guys, my name is Tu. In this short video, I'll be showing you on how do we create custom button here to change the background from white color and also dark color. So notice that the dark color button is already inside. Uh, this button is already here. So what we need to customize is only the button white. So the white color button is actually a macro, uh, is pointing to a macro. So let's quick. Let me quickly show you on how we create this button from scratch. I will just throw this button for now. Okay. First of all, we need to press Ctrl Shift R in our keyboard to start the macro recording. So let's try to press Ctrl Shift and R. And now we are landed on the macro recording dialog box. So give it a quick name. For example, uh, I would like to record a new macro called White 4. And now I would like to go to uh, menu and change the background color preference background change to plain and change the plain color to white color and okay now the macro is already completed we will need to quit uh, recording the macro to quit recording the macro simply press ctrl shift and r again to terminate the macro recording so we already created a macro which is at the desktop here probably you would like to save this file into somewhere safer rather than put it on the desktop. So now let's quickly create the button uh, to initiate the macro. So we will right click on the empty space uh, and the ribbon tab and choose customize. Now we'll drag uh, from the commands tab, we'll drag to the bottom and choose new item, new user command and drag a new user command into the uh, ribbon tab of the view, uh, view ribbon tab. Right click on this button uh, and rename this uh, button name as white. Press enter to accept the changes. Right click again on this button and choose edit action. From the type view, need to scroll and choose macros and browse to the newly created macro which is white for OK and OK. So probably you would like to have another pair, uh, a pair of buttons which is white and uh, dark color. So what we can do is we can go and search for a dark color. Sorry, um, all commands, dark background, and just drag this button over to here. Close this customized dialog box, and now we can try to test the buttons as such. So the background color successfully changed from white and black color. And so this concludes the demonstration video. I hope you enjoy it. Thank you very much.